Oh, goodness. Let me just put some clothes on. Put the wand away, <laughs> my wife used to say. Hello and welcome, my friends. I am a guy who smokes weed, and today we have something special. Today we are continuing our next fest journey with a little game called Fabledom. Fabledom touts itself as the ideal laid-back city builder. We can grow your settlement, trade or challenge your neighbors, use diplomacy or not, but most importantly, find yourself a prince or princess and live happily ever after. I actually didn't know about that last part until right now. It looks like a who. It looks real cute. I'm very excited to play. But of course, first, we must smoke the good good. And today's good good is Mimosa by Delectable Dabs. Let's get to smoking. Now that we are properly baked, time to check out Fabledom. I am so very excited. We're just gonna... I, I, I loaded in for just a moment to check out audio, but I haven't watched this. I was able to skip this. Oh, not this exactly. There's gonna be a thing. Um, but first, we have to choose our, I guess, uh, seed. Our, our, our randomly generated thing. You can... Uh, I haven't clicked this. I was just gonna, like, find a new map. Oh, that's cool. See, I like games like this where we get to kind of choose a thing going on. We get to choose out of these kind of like, they like outline different provinces or something. So we get to like kind of see. I think like this would be cool. This is like a very, I don't know, it's very long. We have lots of access to water. Uh, our forests are dense. Our hills are few though. Uh, so I don't know, like, I don't know what the ideal scenario is here, what we would like to find. Um, but I, I don't know, uh, Griwith sounds kind of fun. I am a prince looking for a, pr you know what, Annie, I am bisexual and I'm going to show my representation. Why not? My name is a guy who smokes weed. I didn't know about this looking for a prince or princess angle about this game. I'm not sure what that is all about, but I'm excited. Yeah, this is what I haven't seen. Once upon a time it goes, a story told of love and woes, when all the kings and queens of yore sent forth their children to explore. New lands of plenty, fields and trees, fertile, yielding, birds and bees. It's your turn, prince or princess you. Discover, conquer, daring do. Remember, friend, tis not just sword that makes one lady or a lord. To build a kingdom, tis an art. But don't neglect your spirit's heart. Through love or war, these lands ignited shall ever after be united. Now go. Be kind, be cruel, be scrappy, and make your ever after happy. Okay, well that explains the the prince princess angle a little more. Oh, hello, Gracie. All righty, we can continue. Our little Gracie puppy is always interrupting my recording, and that is okay because she is adorable. So yeah, we start off. We have our little area. It looks like we are confined, maybe to. Oh yeah, so this is you know this I've seen this kind of we we've we've. It's like reminds me of Sim City or something, where you kind of have to go buy or uh, city skylines. You have to go buy different plots of land. So we've got our we've got our objective. We will claim oh, our reward. Oh yes, our kingdom began with little more than a humble laborer's hut. Now, where did that go again? Hmm. Where did that go? I don't know. Where did that go? I guess we'll put it. 
Let's put it next to trees. I don't know. Oh, well, let's, let's, let's put it right there. I don't know if that m means anything. Laborers construct buildings as long as the required materials are available. Uh, it looks like if we click on our cart, we have storage for vegetables, wood, and stone. And then uh, we can assign. So can I just click on you and then right click there? Or left click there? No, I actually have to come over here and then just click assign. What if I don't want it to be John Garcia? Oh, we have John and Tom Garcia. Oh, we have the Garcias working. Okay, okay. So I guess we're, we're a prince who has been sent off to just build a kingdom. What do we have to do? We have to build a road. How do I build a road? Roads. I didn't, why didn't I hear the road part? Uh, let's build a road. Why not? Let's, let's go in there. That's kind of cool. Maybe we'll go to the cart too. Why not? And then we could build a homestead. Oh, we can claim. Construction of a home. Constructing a home. Build a homestead. Build two homestead attachments inside the new garden and build a sign a how to <coughs> a house a, a head of household. So we have money as well as materials that we will need to uh, understand that that's the thing. I don't, uh, we'll just put it here. Why not? And then, and then this is kind of cool. I, so yeah, I got like this far in the tutorial in my little audio testing. You get to like, you could like, watch this. I can click. And I can like make a thing. You see this? And it like extends. It gives them like a little fence, gives them maybe like, an outhouse, like whatever, it kind of fills in. That's really fun. I like, I like the kind of dynamic thing going on there. And then we can also, oh, we can actually, oh, we can randomize. Oh, oh, that's so cool. Or we can like place things down ourselves. We like here's a clothing line, and here's a small chicken coop. Can we rotate it? Or a greenhouse? How do we rotate? R. Oh, so these actually do things. Oh, they're not just for looks. Very good to know. So, clothing lines, they all just add desirability, but we can also do homegrown. Not during the winter. Okay, so we got like little things. So interesting. Well, I don't know. I want a doghouse because maybe there will be a dog. Let's build that, and then I assume our laborers, yes, the good old Garcias, will come over here, and they will build. Right? Yeah, grab that, Garcia. That's what I'm talking about. You're, you're not going to help? <laughs> it's one, one per, I guess. We have trees. They have five health, apparently. Payment made, income, zero coins. I'm guessing we may collect taxes. From uh, from houses and, and other things. Well, we have <coughs> Ooh -hoo, the first homestead. Yippee! This is where okay. So we need to build another house to too. Eat. A head of household is required for the homestead to operate smoothly. Now make sure one has been assigned, won't you? I'm gonna place it this way. I don't know why not. What is that? You see, what is... Huh. Area size needs to at least be a 2 by 2 Why isn't this... Well, that's weird. I don't like that. I don't like that. Don't do it. Oh god, what am I doing? Head of household. Yes, I understand, but I'm trying to... Destroy. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. Um... Oh, we have lots. Okay. See, I clicked on basics and I was like, oh, there's there's only like three things. Like I'm gonna be able to build in this. But no, there's there is plenty of things. Oh, we have water resource as well. It looks like okay, we are. Alright, so we need to set a set of how a ho house of head Oh god. Set a house Oh, isn't there? you're the head of house. Oh, we're good. I like how we've got the Garcias and they're like, nah, nah, nah. It's it's the lone the lone girl who's the hell. I like that. I like that a lot. So we have another hut. I feel like we should build another hat hut because we have... I'm going to give them a three-thing <laughs> yard because 
Why not? Currently in realm three. My computer is making some fun noises. Uh, let's destroy the attachments and then let's, we'll give them an outhouse and we will give them an apple tree. I think that's cute. And then we will build that for 55. And then I guess we need water. Provides water to homesteads in the area. Oh yes, okay, so we have utility. Good to know. I guess we can build that like right here. That seems to be like probably what's gonna be a good, although are they gonna be able to get around from now? Oh yeah, it looks like maybe they can get around fairly. Hopefully, hopefully once that's built, they can actually get around. Well, we have another laborer's hut we could build. I don't know what do we, uh, we... Oh, we can... Okay, well, that's that's the thing we're going to need. We're going to need logs. Lumber camp. Nice. We can place that... We can place that over here, right? Yeah, I like that. And then we can build a road... Over there. Nice. Look at this cute little town already coming up. We got the Garcias are on the case. We've got our two huts, which have us. Uh, we now have enough space for two more people. I don't know how we gain villagers, but goddamn, do I love myself a, a colony simulator. This shit's always so fun. So I guess we build. A, we can build a whole fancy castle one day. Oh, Here come our first newcomers. Oh. As long as you keep your population happy, more will come <coughs> to join. Well, as long as Where are they coming room, from? Of course. Welcome, welcome. Oh, nice. So we filled... Welcome. Two newcomers. Nice. Two out of two visitors want to stay. So they'll have... They'll come and, and not all of them will stay all the time, maybe. So we've got our lumber camp. We should assign someone there, I feel like. At least one person, right? We need to gather lumber. We only have 40. We also have stockpiles. Okay. So I guess we need... We can put these back here, I feel like. Right? That makes sense. Oh, and then we can... One, two... Oh, okay. So we can't put it there. Because we don't have enough room. But we can put it here. And we can build the stockpiles right there. I think that's kind of a fun little place. Mm, this can't be right. It seems you got a letter from a secret admirer, odd. Well, I suppose there's no accounting for taste. Did it just Josh? <laughs> you can open it by <laughs> just clicking Josh. the letter icon at the top center of your screen. Oh, I see. You will let me know if there's anything good. I don't I don't get out much anymore. Letter from Giovanni. Oh, Giovanni. Hello, beautiful prince. You are absolutely the talk of the new realm. Look at us. We are sitting on a gold mine. Would you be interested in a business partnership and a Cupid permitting a partner and more? Have your fablings call my fablings. <laughs> Giovanni the Merchant Prince. Okay, Giovanni. Coming on strong. We're building our stockpile. Well, it looks like some newcomers will arrive no. soon. But there's no oh, yes, we need housing. more housing, yes. Uh, to see how many days are left until the next arrival, hover over the population icon. Ah, we're seven days. So we have seven days. Okay. That's not much. I mean, that's not... That, that doesn't seem too bad. Um, is this... Will, will this be here forever? What if I demolish... Continue. Can I demolish you? Are you gonna... Do we just need to empty you, maybe? Once we empty you, are you going to be good? I feel like. All right, so stockpile. Let's assign somebody to the stockpile. And then we can't go this way yet with our road, but we will go this way. Because that's kind of a nice... I feel like that's a nice... This game looks fucking fantastic. I am very into it. Um, let's make sure we get our little house. Nice. And we will build that. We're running low on lumber, so let's definitely assign someone else to the lumber. Oh, we don't have anybody available. Okay, good to know. We've got two builders. Wait a second. 
So we have two builders, one stockpile person, and two... Oh, so do head of households... Is that a job? Is that an actual job? Like, that is their thing they are assigned to? I believe it may be. Huh. Yeah, everybody's employed. If I click here... Yeah, so this is a job. Good to know. So someone will move in there at some point. Are oh, you just going to build some things back there? That's very nice. I, I kind of want a chicken coop. If I select hub and then go to attachments. Can I, can I just like destroy you? Yes. Oh, that's cool. And then I can build my own attachment. I kind of want a chicken coop in this one. I think that'd look really good. <clears throat> Let's do that. This kind of reminds me of, um... Oh, it kind of reminds me a little bit of, the like, the dynamics. Everything, the dynamicness of it is kind of reminds me of Urbex Sitting City Builder. Urbex City Builder, which I really like that game as well. Alright, well, we got our cute little homestead. We are gathering lumber... Uh, we don't have any vegetables. Or we, we do have vegetables. We're not producing any vegetables. Are we... Is everybody in the in the thing? It is. We will need a new one here soon. I'm going to put it right here. I think that will encompass everything. Cool. Military, fortifications, decorations. Oh, this is cute. We can just, like, decorate things. Can I just, like, can just like put some... Plants along the road, if we would like. Or a tree, or a public outhouse. Let's put a public outhouse. Does that do anything? That, uh, no, it doesn't, actually. <laughs> I thought maybe it would. I'm sure... I, I, it'd be kind of cool if it gave people, like, happiness, right? Okay. So... We can show all. all we can do all, all the time. That's kind of nice. So are these, are they like tier two? Oh, okay. Prismic liquid refinery. Holy shit, this game's gonna get crazy. Uh, probably not in the demo, but oh, welcome. Did we get, did we get the newcomers? We did. Nice. We can assign someone new to the lumber. We That is it. Oh, maybe we should, uh, oh. Okay, well, they're gonna go work the lumber yard for now, but maybe afterwards they should be. War they should. Uh, we need a farmer. Where's our farmer? So yeah, we need to build a farm. We need to collect two hundred dollars in taxes. Um, I guess the farm can be out here. I don't know how big of an area we need for farming. So let's. Well, let's. I guess we could just see. We could see what this does. Yeah, so we can do a large area with a farm. So, good to know. Let's cancel that. Let's... I think I want... Well, I feel like, are we going to need this stone? Like, should I leave? I guess I can leave that. Yeah, let's build it. Why not? Let's build it right there. And let's just drag out a nice... Oh. Let's drag out a nice area for farmland. Maybe like that size for now. That way we can leave this open in case we need to build some kind of quarry or something there. And we still have room to go down this way with a road. Let's build that. Farming crops will grow over time as long as it is at least one farmer assigned to the farm. And I'm assuming we can increase production with more farmers potentially. Alright, he is... The good old Giovanni on the case. Not Giovanni. The Garcias. Yes. That Tom Garcia, I believe. I like the building animations. It's really slick. That is cool. Do you have to build each farm? Into, like, how does that work? Is this just gonna... Is it gonna finish and everything's gonna be done? Yeah, it looks like it. And we got pumpkins. We are just gonna grow lots of pumpkins. Uh, so we're gonna, I think we're gonna, let's, let's, Ralph, let's get you off. And let's get you over here. 
Nice. And then hopefully you can start doing that. We've got our little stockpiles of wood. Wood and wood. Nice. God, the way this game looks is just so... Everything's so fluid and dynamic. Like, I like that they're actually, like, they're carrying boxes over here, and this is slowly filling up. I'm, I'm sure it's not one per one, but, like, just the way it kind of looks like it builds up over time. It's really lovely. Cool. I'm, I'm, I'm loving this. Oh, we got, we got Ralph out here spreading his seed all over the place. Good job, Ralph. Oh, we can claim. I didn't even... I'm not looking down here. <laughs> so what am I blocking? Oh, I'm not actually blocking anything. I, I, you can... There's nothing to the right of these vegetables that I'm actually in the way of. So that's very nice. Oh, household, household one out of two peasants. Housed one out of two peasants. Oh, are we... Oh, shit. So we need more... We need more homesteads already, for sure. That's, uh, I guess we're going to go this way now. So we can eventually get cobblestone roads, which is cool. Let's go this way. Hmm. We'll go down this way. We'll go straight this way, I think. Yes. Because eventually this is gonna this is gonna link up, I think, in my mind. Same thing. We can kind of go out this way, and curve around that way. Once this cart's gone, it'll be great. <laughs> it's just food in there. And then we can come out here and we can build some more houses. Let's build. We can build one right here, right? And we can build our little... I kind of want to... I would have loved to pre preserve that. The, uh... The thing. You know the thing? The thing. Cool, that's, that's, that's fine. Let's build that. Getting a nice little court. Kind of central hub. Oh, they are, they are fell in those trees. Good to know. Good to know. So we actually have to worry about getting more trees. Okay, so we really don't want to be probably removing our own trees. Oh, we've got pumpkins being planted. That's so, so beautiful. So we still need to collect $200 in taxes. And we need to place three decorations. Oh, yeah, we've already done one. Look at us. The public outhouse. Um... Where's the decorations? There we are. Well, we have a public outhouse. Let's get a nice, I guess, let's get a flower bed. Why not? Oh, we can choose different flower beds. Let's do pink. Can we do it? Where can we do it? We just do it like right here. Nice little public flower bed. And we can do a planted tree. Let's do one right here just to kind of give some shade. Why not? I think that's pretty place or claim. Reach population milestone hamlet. Yeah, so I don't know what kind of... I see we can get lots of people eventually. We now have room for 12 people. Let's just build another house. Let's just future-proof a little bit. We don't want to be caught again with our... Let's do that. I don't like this little thing. I don't... Remove that. Yes. I said yes. Yes! A little bug in there, I guess. Um, that's okay. Let's just unconfirm those. And let's grab another dog house. And let's do... They, they all have greens. They will be composting. No, not remove. Build. There we go. Cool. We got our next house. They're going to be little neighbors right there. And then the Garcias are on it. We've got 30 food. Have we produced any food from the farm? I don't believe so. Can we assign anybody? Let's assign another worker to the farm. I think that's probably... Ooh, look at that. Those are some fucking pumpkins. Oh, milestone reached. 
Goodness gracious, we've already managed to find enough fablings brave enough to entrust, or sorry, to entrust us with their livelihood to call ourselves a hamlet. Territories. We can buy new territories to expand your kingdom. In, oh, so we've, we've been rewarded with some uh, new buildings, which is cool. Is there is there something weird going on with the pathing path there? So we've got a stone camp that we can build, and it seems like it's going to make people sad if we build it. Must connect to a stone deposit. Okay, well, that's that's like that. Okay. Can I rotate it? I can, if I'd like. Um, so let's, yeah, we can put you right here, I think. That actually won't affect anybody besides the, uh, the mining camp. I mean, the uh, farmers, but I don't know if that's something we have to worry about because it's another workplace. We can put that there. We can build our road, connecting it. There we go. Is that being built? It is. Then we can make coal from wood. Which I'm sure we will need for something. Oh, coal will be used to warm up households and fuel production. So I'm guessing during the winter, which is summer, that we will have to prepare for the winter with crops that we will need to store. And coal to make sure houses are warm and people aren't dying. We're going to build our first little granary right here. Nice. I think that's a a spiffy place for it. Oh, it's raining. Oh, we're going to get nice wet roads. Oh, that looks so pretty. This game is just gorgeous. It runs well. It's fun seeing the villagers. They actually have the jobs. They're doing the jobs. You guys just talking. You're having a good time. I guess there are some people who are unemployed. We should probably assign another worker to the that, and we could probably assign somebody. Butris, thank you for working in the mines. You gonna go sit down, have a seat, or are you gonna work? What do you do? Nice! Oh, you're gonna get up there and you're gonna fucking swing that pickaxe. Hell yeah. Alright. The Garcia's chilling, waiting for some building orders. Well, I can give you some building orders. So far, we really haven't ran into any resource management. Like, I've just kind of had enough everything for everything I've wanted to build as soon as I would like to. Uh, I feel like we should build our set. Oh, do we have... Oh, we finally have... The, uh... What is it called? We can build a road. Yeah, we can connect the roads. Nice. So I say we have a nice... We should build an inn. Does everything have water? Everything does have water. Um, we should build an inn for happiness. We can build it. I mean, that's a, that's not a bad place for it, right? Because I would get everything. Uh, sorry, outhouse, but I think you're gonna have to go. Oh no! I really like that building. I know, but we can put it right here. And we can get everything nice and encompassed. And everybody can go to the inn and have some mead and enjoy a hearty drink. After a long day on the farms. Or the mines. Or the lumberyard. All the fun jobs. Oh, we need stone. We don't have a lot of stone. Good to know. Well, that will be built whenever we get enough stone, I guess. Huh? It's up to you, Butrus. We got... Did we just get new people, right? Yeah, there we go. So... How do we know who people... Do we, any, unemployed. We have one unemployed person. Good person. Or good job. How, do we have anywhere for you to work? The lumber yard seems to be... Yeah, we need to demolish the lumber, lumber yard, right? Attachments, Forester. Plants new trees after they've been cut down. <gasps> oh my god, yes. Why would we not want to do that? That's fantastic. So if I put that there, will they just replant the trees right here? Let's see how that goes. Nice, Garcia, you're on the case. Okay, so we just need nine more stone. 
We've got Butrus and Cecilia working at the mines, putting in the work, carrying the rest of these peasants on their back. Let's grab another homestead. Um, I feel like we don't want to waste this stuff over here. Let's, let's, let's make sure we can keep a road going that way. Make you a smaller house. Why not? You can still have the amenities. What is that? An apple tree? And a small greenhouse? That works. Cool, cool, cool. Build another one on the corner right here. Build... We're going to be uh, getting a little cramped here soon. We're starting to really fill out our area. Oh, nice. Anyway, the inn adds happiness to its surroundings. The happier your kingdom is, Damn. the more newcomers it will attract. Well, that's unfortunate. We didn't have anywhere for them to stay. So they didn't. <laughs> Unfortunate. Oh, we have an overview menu. Oh, I have not looked into this. We've got workplaces. Tells you what they need or who they have. Good to know. Okay. Oh, we need somebody working at the granary. Good to know. What is that? Hunger? Y'all hungry? Do we have enough food? We do. We do have enough food. Good to know. Well, we're going to need to... Oh, yeah, we're almost uh, at storage limit. So let's get rid of... I don't know who that was. Who are you? Matilda, thank you for now working at the granary. I feel like that's probably... That seems like a better job than working the farm, right? You're at least just sitting in the granary doing granary things instead of being out in the harsh farmland. So I feel like that's a promotion. So good job. Our stockpile seems to be holding up fine. Although, do we have nowhere to put wood, or will, do these all need to... I don't know how that works. Oh, we have planted trees. Look at that. Oh, hell yeah. So you're just sitting around now, right? Yeah, you're chilling. Because you've planted trees, you're just waiting for them to grow. Oh, it's fall. Ooh, okay, it's fall. Good to know. We are getting... Uh, produce 15 coal. We should probably do that. Are we, we finally, we're filling the grain area up? Yes, we are. Nice. Oh, we, yeah, we moved all. Good job, Matilda. That was, that was quick work. Oh, we have chickens. Oh, my God. So, do we have a dog? <gasps> Is there a dog? Oh, my God, where's the dogs? There needs to be dogs. Oh, we don't have any lumber. Oh, golly. Good to know. We're just waiting for these trees to grow. Oh, but they've definitely grown, right? Okay, so you're out there chopping away now. Good job. So we're starting to produce lumber. Okay, so here we go. We're finally running into some resource management. Because um, I haven't been paying attention. <laughs> Let's speed it up. Oh, we got new decorations. We have a circular table. It's like somewhere people can just like chill out. That'd be cool. Let's put it right here. Why not? Let's just like... Oh, it's outside of the inn. That makes so much sense, right? Go out there, have a drink or two. Oh, we don't have a... Did that just get built? I Damn. Damn. Okay, well, we need eight more days. Next milestone is 18. Is that because that's how much I have for housing? Hmm. Oh, the winter's come. The winter has come. Okay, I'm going to slow it down a little bit because it's freaking me out. Oh, the homestead. They need coal. Oh, boy. We are... Oh, we might have just fucked ourselves. Okay. That's not good. Um. Well, then. I know it's negative desirability, but we, we kind of need it right now, don't we? Oh, I can put it back here with the... Uh... Let's put it right... Like that? Maybe. Yeah, let's put it right here. At the end of the road, we can build the road out. Um, wow, I got real snowy real quick. Oh, but it's so pretty. Isn't it? Um, we've got the gravel road going down. Everybody needs coal. Everybody's cold. Sorry. Maybe we should have invested in some parkas. 
Uh, are you going to go... Okay, Garcia's on the job. Oh, we need stone, which we have plenty of. Which is good to know. Um, I feel like we need to divert... Okay, farmer. Okay, you're not doing anything during the winter, are you? At all. Oh, so can we just not farm at all during the winter? Okay, well, we need to get this shit going quickly. So let's... Did we not build the coal thing? No, we did build the coal thing. Or we are building the coal thing. So let's get uh, people to the Forester. Off the farm. Do you need to work there still? I'm going to let you work there because I maybe you're passing out food. I'm not sure. Roughly 64 days of food remaining, which should get us through... I don't know. It says Winter 5. Is that the fifth month? I am not sure. Oh, that's the day, right? Are we 30 days of winter? Is that how that works? Is it 30 days? Like a month? But then it's not a month, exactly. Uh, oh, Secret Santa! Oh, I got a... Uh... Oh, I got coal! I got coal! Someone gave me coal! <laughs> what is this? Is this a box? I can place it down? Oh, it just, like, has coal. Right? Somebody want to get that coal? You're going to go get the coal? Oh, you're getting the coal. Nice. And now there's nothing in it. Okay, good to know. Oh. Nope, you grabbed the whole box. <laughs> okay, so we at least have coal. That's a very nice game. Thank you. <laughs> it's like, I know you fucked up. So we won't make it so you really fuck up. Uh, which I appreciate. All right, we're getting we're getting this built. We need more wood, but we're finally we're finally getting some wood thanks to these. Uh... I'm glad we planted those trees. I'm glad we figured that out. So that's good to know. Okay, it seems like households are some of them warming up. Um, one of them still doesn't have enough for coal. we don't have enough coal for one of them, but we are about to hopefully start producing coal. Uh, but we will need more trees. Okay, so that's good. We just got two more peasants. You're like, I, I get it. You're probably out there in the cold. You don't want to be cold. Makes sense. Although one became a, held, a head of household, I believe, so. We only have one new worker, I believe. Yeah. Okay. We're going to speed it up a little bit. Y'all are going hard. All right, let's get somebody at the coal production for sure. Is that you? You heading out there? Who we got? Matilda, Matilda, you are everywhere. Do we have more than we have more than one Matilda? Oh, that's Matilda Humphrey instead of Matilda Lopez. Good to know. Okay, we're, we're, what are we doing over here? What is this? What is this all about? Oh, you guys are gathering Looks trees from over there. there. Oh, look, Good to know. That's the second dick joke game, <laughs> or wand dick joke, I guess. I mean, both of them were wand dick jokes. Not just any dick joke. All right, so hopefully we're producing some coal. Oh, hell yeah, Matilda. You fucking put that wood in there and make it into coal. Okay, well, we are going. We're starting to finally get some, some wood back in the stockpile. Which hopefully will turn into to many, many... Oh yeah, we're producing our coal... Oh, we have to do something to the in the overview menu. We need to assign someone to work with this. Oh. Oh, yeah. We got another... Uh... Another milestone. All right. We're filling our houses up very quickly. We probably need some more houses, but we really don't have the coal for those houses. Oh, a street theater. That's fun. Oh, we got our first tier two building. A sawmill. Well, we should maybe just open the whole thing up. And a messenger's guild. Oh. So that's how we kind of probably... Increase our diplomatic relationship relations with people, maybe. 
Times have been hard. We have tried our best to put food on the table, but are are out, are out of options. We heard of your good heart and decided to swallow our pride and come here to beg you to help us. I'll gladly help hand over 30 vegetables. Oh, sure. I think we have enough to survive still. Oh, okay. Did I just... <laughs> oh, I wanted the nobility. Oh, well, that's 26 days of food remaining. Oh, and we should hopefully... Assuming it's this 30 days, we should be out of winter uh, in just a moment. So maybe we're going to be okay still and we can start farming again. So what happens when you're cold? All right, we'll assign workers back to the farm now that it is spring. So it is 30 days, so I need 30 days worth of food, which we had plenty of, so I'm I'm glad we could just get rid of that. But we do are we are now just out of food again. So we will need to get that farm up and running quickly. So that's good that we're doing that. Oh, we are out of buildings again. Territories. Oh, here we go. We could uh so we can purchase more territory. It kind of tells you an overview of what's going on. If we have trees, there's ruins, there's iron deposits, stone deposits. I feel like that maybe makes sense. We can get the hills up here. And that has an iron deposit somewhere. Oh, and there's some sheeps. Escape. Oh, well, we can claim. Claim. We can claim. We got lots of things. We need a messenger's guild. Let's build one of those. We will need some more housing. Nice. The Garcias are killing it. And we can welcome our new peasants. Okay, so things are really uh, getting going now. So we've got... We're starting to get somewhat of a stockpile of food back again. Hopefully. We have enough, we have plenty of room for new villagers. World events. Immigrants in need. Prince, your grace, we have recently left our own realm due to the horrible conditions we were forced to live in. We were hoping to settle here with you, however, we could use some coin to help us get started. We promise to walk hard. Uh, hand over 200 gold, receive two peasants. Absolutely. I have a, 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 an influx of gold. I really seem to have a lot. And we can always use more peasants. Do we need any jobs? Do we have any jobs that need assigning to? I don't believe so. So we really need to probably get some jobs for these people. Um, let us see. Is everything still within the water? Yes, it is. We have a farm. We have greeneries. I mean, let's let's build a, a thing. Why not? I don't know. We can build happiness. I'm just trying to build things. Um, we can put it right here on the ocean. That might be really cool. And then we can just build a road like that. Cool. And then what else can we build? We can build our first sawmill, which will. What does it do? Produces planks from wood. Oh, so that gives us planks, which I'm sure will be a whole new thing. Um, let's see. That's that's a good place for it, for sure. At least I think that's a good place for it. It's not going to take any trees down, and we're going to have it. The Garcias are on it. Eventually, I'm sure we will need another laborer help, but, hut, but so far, the Garcias are unstoppable. So, I've got no qualms there. Nothing to say. So, have I... So, I know I could build something for the lumber camp. Can I build something for anything else? I can build... Oh, I can eventually get wheat as a farm, as a crop. The inn doesn't have anything now. I don't know what this is going to have. Oh, we need planks for that. Oh, so good thing we're making the uh, sawmill. Is that planks too? That's no, just wood. Oh, that is wooden planks. Okay. 
So we're encountering our new resource that we will need. So that's a sign. We got Isabella for the sawmill. I hope you enjoy your new career choice, Isabella. Or career assignment. Oh, look at her go! That's so cool. A little animation, and somebody's actually picking up the boxes. Oh, is that Gar? Is that the Garcias? Yes. Go build our messengers' guild. Oh, I could just purchase more territory if I would like. I don't know why not. <laughs> it's cool. Oh, they go up in price each time, but I have more than enough gold. I could buy a lot. I don't know when this demo ends. Pigs. Oh my god. How they have wings. Pigs? They're I so they cute. End up getting eaten. I bet they will. They're plump and friendly. The wings are non-functional. I bet. There's fishies out here, too. Oh yeah, we also have the sheeps. They're very fluffy. They look kind of like brains. I don't like that. Can we build road up? Can we go uppies? How does that work? Too steep? Maybe? Too close to a hill? So can we just not utilize anything up here? Maybe I can go that way? Oh, that's a pretty waterfall. Hell yeah. Oh, we have another world event. Pesky fairies. Prince farmers have reported issues with swarms of red-winged fairies spreading in their crops. They worry that if we do not address this issue, we risk losing some valuable resources. Oh, I don't want to exterminate the fairies. You know, we're going to let the fairies be. They're cute. It's a farming hazard. It's it's, it's what it's going to be. Are we finally done with the Messenger's Guild? Oh, yes. We're about to build it. Oh, these building animations are slick. They're, they're just nice. They're cool. Oh, that's tight. Are these going to be like owls? Or like messenger pigeons? I hope it's pigeons. I like pigeons. So we're going to assign someone to work here. How many uh, un unemployed people? That's the last one. Cool. So we now have the Messenger's Guild unlocked, which means we can... Oh, yes. Okay, so this is our world map, which we chose from during the original thing. The world map is used to interact with other rulers, complete missions, and more. Click any occupied realm to get started. Only two realms are currently occupied during the demo. Realms with names are occupied and can be selected. Okay. Well, I like Solaria. I don't know. That's just a cool name. Let's send a message to Solaria. We have a chance of success. 100%. We have seven days remaining until that happens. So, let's speed this bad boy up. Flour. I'm assuming we get that from bread, which we will need to turn it in just in some in some way. Oh, we've claimed that. Greetings. Send out a messenger. Once a messenger arrives, greet the ruler of the newly discovered realm. Alright. Do we have anything else we can build currently? I don't think so. I think we kind of... We've, we've... We've... Oh, are we watching a play? Oh, wait. <laughs> They're cardboard cutouts watching a play. We haven't employed anybody here. I want to employ somebody here. Let's employ someone from... You know what? You've had you've you've worked hard at the mines. Who we got? Cecilia and Beatrice. Well, Beatrice, you started here, so let's get you over at the theater. I think people will enjoy that. I was just gonna be enjoyment for these houses over here. So we we have plenty of fucking stone. We have lots of veggies. We have coal being produced in quantities that it will be sufficient for winter, hopefully. Um, chapter two: Meet Cute, Discovered Realm. Oh, this is our, our, um... Oh, hello, greetings. Welcome to my bountiful kingdom. I trust that your intentions are honorable. A pleasure to meet you. Please accept this gift as a token of our friendship. Gift 
Oh, we, we, oh, we can, oh, we can send, send vegetables, of course. Okay. Got a whole thing. Oh, we have, like, a friend bar. Adversary, I like that. That's cool. You can get become an adversary, or you can become, what does it say? Is it gonna pop up? Wait. We can send spies? <laughs> Each realm has a ruler with their own personality, missions, rewards to earn, to learn more. You have a relationship with each ruler that is affected by your interactions. Some interactions require specific relationship level. For example, to start courting, you must be friends. <laughs> and we need to bring them 20 tulips. Let's well, send a messenger. Please accept a gift. Do I even have that much? No, I have a lot, I think. I can just send well wishes. Yeah, just send will wishes. Why not? I'm going to be blunt. I don't like you. <laughs> and I do not agree with how you rule your kingdom. That's funny. The Harvest Princess. Okay, well, let's, uh, we can wave. Let us exit the map. Don't claim our that. rewards. Oh! Your story was just getting started. Oh, but it doesn't end here. <laughs> doesn't have to. Let me tell you a story you cannot resist. Of bandits dissed, of sweethearts kissed, endless twists you cannot miss when you wish upon a list. <laughs> I won Fabled and Idol with that one. Uh, well, thank <laughs> you for playing and come back soon. And when you do, uh, maybe bring soup or uh, something warm to eat. I'm so lonely. Well, that was fantastic. That was so lovely. It was such a nice, cute game. I'm very excited to play more of it. I will definitely be streaming that game when it comes out and probably making a video here or two. But uh, thank you, any and all, for watching. Once again, if you liked what you see, you can check it out. The demo is on Steam Next Fest, but that will be over by the time you see this video. Or still, feel free to go wishlist the game. I encourage you to do so if you liked what you saw and or follow it on Steam. That's all I've got today, people. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.